everyone, welcome back. So today we're here because we're looking at all of your beautiful art pieces. So wait, where are they? Over wow. there. And some more over and there. And some more over there. And we are helping to judge a little bit on the art competition. There's no winners, but we have chosen two of our favorites. Which really stood out to us. So Marcus, you want to start about the first, with the first one that really stood out to us? Yeah. Leaf Fish by Ray in year two in 2KED. This, we loved it because it's a fish on a leaf. It was so creative. We were like, we would never have thought of making something like that. Yeah, and I can't. I can't draw a stick, man. So yeah, neither can I. Yeah. I wish I could. And we thought it was very. So we loved leaf fish. We did. We well really done, did. Ray. And then there was another one which we really, really loved, which is we oh. can't pick it up sadly, which is the macaroni dog, as we named it. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> there. And this was done by Milo in year one, and we once again, we love the fact that it has texture to it, also leaves and um, all the macaroni and pastas, and we yeah. just thought it was super creative. Yeah. So. Oh, I'm back. <laughs> so, well done Milo in year one. And Ray in year two. So, bye. bye. So, this is the one that caught my eye. And it's a painting by Lottie in year three. The reason it caught my eye was the colours and it's very very bright and vibrant and Lottie has obviously spent a long time tried really really hard to get all those different patterns and colours into her beagle I think it's a beagle correct so I thought that was a wonderful um, entry and that's the one that caught my eye so well done Lottie hi everyone I'm Mr Bloomfield I'm an art teacher in secondary school um, and I have chosen this by Anna Julia of 4KFR. And whilst there are many, many fantastic pieces, and I do love so many of them, I really just loved this clay piece of Milo the cat. And I just thought it was amazing. I really, really like it. So, well done. My name is Miss Aston, and I'm a teacher in Year 6. And I've been selected to be one of the judges for the art competition. So I've been downstairs to where all the art is displayed and I've chosen the one that caught my eye the most and I chose it because of its lovely colours and it's from Victoria in Miss Fitzgerald's class and I love this one because it's painted on glass and she's used glass paints and she's also given a really good explanation I'll just try and show you of how she painted it and how long it took her. So well done, Victoria. Hi everyone, I'm Miss Natalie and the piece of art that I have, chose, have chosen is this one and it's by Elia in year three. And the reason I've chosen it is because I love the way the dog looks like it's moving and this sort of looks like there's wind and I love the texture around of the grass all around and it sort of feels like it's moving. And um, it's just wonderful. It makes me want to meet this little doggy. Hola, yo he elegido el dibujo de Matisse de año 2 del grupo de Miss Georgia porque me parece que tiene mucha luz y es bastante expresivo. Gracias, adiós. Hello, I'm Miss Moore from um, the art department in secondary and this is the one that caught my eye. I really like it. I like it because it's really, really colourful and um, whoever's painted it has used really big, bold strokes and I like that very much. And this person is Elena from 6PSM. So well done, Elena. Love it. Hi, it's Miss Celine from the library. Uh, I've so enjoyed looking at all this beautiful art for the art competition um, and the piece that I've chosen that really stood out for me was this beautiful drawing of a hamster by uh, Adriana Rosas in 6KFI and the reason this stood out for me was that I had a pet hamster as a, as a young girl um, and I remember the hamster sitting on my finger um, and the feeling of the little claws um, on my finger. And so it brought it all back. And it really made me think about the special relationship between um, owners and their pets and how much trust the, the animals put in us um, to take care of them. Uh, and I, I love this, I love the eyes of the 
hamster as well. I think Adriana has done a beautiful sketch here and that really stood out for me. <laughs> okay, thank you and well done to all the children for producing such wonderful creative work. Hello, good morning everyone. My name is Mr. Bruno Martellotta. I am a secondary drama teacher. And well, I was here checking all the excellent pieces of art that you, the primary students, created. First of all, congratulations to all of you. Amazing, amazing job. Super, super talented students that are coming to secondary school soon. So I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, I would like to show this one that really called my attention. It's, uh, an, I, I, in my opinion, it's a super, super interesting piece of art. It was made by the year five student, Sasha. And I find this amazing, the color composition of this piece of art. And especially the way that it's been painted, that it has a certain movement. We could see a clear movement of this beautiful cat with these beautiful green eyes. So the color composition using the blues and the dark blue going to the black and also the contrast between these the, the, the brownish uh, colors of the, um, of the cat. I think it's amazing this contrast that it's done and the entire composition of all this artwork. Okay, so well done. This is brilliant. I really like it and congratulations to all of you. I really want to see more of this. Okay, bye bye.